We're getting an update on the number of surgeons at UAB. The hospital has added more of them to respond to an increase in gunshot victims. Our Lauren Harkson has more on where the trauma team stands right now. Most metropolitan areas are dealing with higher violent crime rates, including right here in Birmingham. Dr. Jeffrey Kirby with UAB says the number of trauma patients they're seeing has doubled over the last eight years. We sort of look at this as a as an epidemic. UAB's trauma and acute care surgery division seeing 1300 patients this year. Dr. Kirby says just eight years ago they saw half that around 600 patients. It's not not atypical for us to take care of between 30 and 40 victims of trauma on a on a Saturday night, Friday or Saturday night. And we can have upwards of 10 to 12 uh, gunshot wound victims on those days. And that's why they needed to hire additional surgeons to keep up with the volume. Eight years ago, we probably had nine faculty surgeons. We've increased that to now 24. Dr. Kirby said they needed more people overnight, too. You know, a lot of times our trauma surgeon will be tied up in the operating room and somebody else may come in who needs emergent operative intervention. So we've had to now increase that number at, at night to two. And for half of the month, we have actually three surgeons in the hospital at all times. And that's just faculty surgeons. They've also increased the number of fellows in training. Dr. Kirby says at this point, they're fully staffed and can manage the patient volume effectively. If somebody gets here who, who comes in with a, with a blood pressure and a pulse uh, and doesn't have a lethal head injury, that, that survival rates are about 95%. Dr. Kirby says UAB is working with the Jefferson County Department of Health to develop hospital-based violence intervention programs to help slow down this growing problem. In Birmingham, Lauren Harkson, WVRC Fox 6 News, on your side.